everyone. Um, please let me know that you can hear me clearly. There's been some issues when I'm trying to record with the internal microphone on the tablet, so let me know that you can hear me. So this is going to be recording regarding more paranormal activity. So I'm going to continue talking about what's been going on. So as of last night, and I've stated many blessings, but it continues to um, it continues to happen. So yesterday, my daddy experienced activity, and he stated that he usually experiences that type of activity when I'm around. Or usually if I'm waking up or if I'm if I'm awake but you know it doesn't happen as often or hardly at all if I'm not around but he heard something in the other room he was sitting on the couch in the living room and he heard someone walk into the kitchen and he said he told us that he stated hello and he thought it was me or Mama, but it wasn't either of us. And right now I'm feeling a cold spot go through my arm, my elbow, like my left elbow. Earlier my Mama felt a really warm, hot energy go through her elbow, go by her, go into her elbow, go through her, and go through her. But back to last night, my daddy heard someone walk into the kitchen, and they, he stated that he heard them open the fridge he heard the fridge open and then close he said he heard the he has said he heard the door open and close as plain as day and he said he heard someone get something and then they put an object down he heard an object uh, drop or fall just he said he heard someone lay something what sounded like someone on a table then he said he heard someone fumbling around, just fumbling around in there, in the other room, right in the other room, and he said it sounded like it came from the door area, back door, and he said they went from the, to the kitchen, he said they went from the kitchen and they got something again and started sounding like they got something and just walked in there and sounded like they just dropped it on the table, laid it on the table. And he stated that they, uh, he said they were tapping, constantly tapping. I've heard a lot of stuff through my life, and this kind of thing hasn't happened in a while. And it started back again. And so he just left and went on to bed after that. He stated he just left the room. He kept saying hello, and he said it wasn't any of us. So, and it wasn't any of us. He said he heard someone go to the restroom, go into the restroom. He'd heard, he'd heard the door, but no one was in there. It wasn't us. He heard a lot of walking. He's heard voices. He heard movements and the same things that I heard. I was laying on the couch, and then I hear someone go into the kitchen and then move around, do things. And then make all kinds of noises. Just a moment ago, I heard like that, and it was like a, just a clap of the hands. It sounded like hand clapping. And when I was walking back, see, there's, we have a, the door, it, the door locks, and then there's a chain. We have a chain that you can chain it up as well. And the, the lock... As I was walking by it, I thought someone was fumbling with the doorknob. I heard someone fumbling with the doorknob, and I seen the doorknob, the door handle moving, and I thought someone was trying to, try, someone was trying to get in. But it wasn't that. There was no one there. No one physical was there. And this just that just happened at about. Let's see. It was a little bit after two o'clock. I'd say about two thirty that that happened, and I thought someone was fumbling with the doorknob. Because the doorknob was turning, and then I, but I noticed that the lock was trying to turn. I thought, what the heck? So I go over there, and I'm, and I try to put the lock, uh, then I try to move the lock and put it back. Then I'm going to unlock it, and then it pushes back. Unlock, and it turns back. 
It's like someone's turning the lock back, like an energy or a force, like there's a hand on it besides mine, turning the lock back on the door. Like, I'm getting a cold energy moving through my left leg right now. It just moved right through my left leg and right through my left arm as I'm, as I'm stating this. I should probably be talking about it lower. But that's what happened. Um, I actually stated many of the phrases last night, many phrases, and then I was stating the other night, and I just I had all the lights turn off. Something just tapped in the other room. I wish I wasn't talking at the moment. If you hear anything on this recording, let me know. If you all hear anything, please let me know in the comments. Um, by the way, thank you so much to the person that sent me the calendar. Thank you so much for sending me that lovely, beautiful Christmas gift. And uh, may the Lord continue to bless you. Thank you so much for that. And uh, thank you so much. That was just awesome. I was so excited to get that. I seen that Amazon package and I thought, what? Well, I, I, was, I, I wasn't aware. There wasn't supposed to be any pa any other packages on the way, and because uh, I had this cord, these uh, char this charger that was on the way, a charger cord, and and a uh, let's see, there was a little reader. Like a there was two for six dollars, so they were three dollars a piece. This reader for USBs for to plug up to your tablet to read files on a card, and that's all I had. And that had already arrived this morning, and I thought. What other package is that? And um, and it turned out to be that uh, beautiful calendar, that astronomy calendar. So thank you so much to you, by the way. Um, you are so you're so precious. You're so special. And thank you for your kind note that you added with it, the gift in the gift receipt, the note that you added with that with that calendar. So thank you so much. I hope you don't mind me stating that in the video. I also emailed you and I responded with a thank you in the. Uh, in the comment section. I'm feeling better now than I was earlier. Oh my goodness, if I uh, felt like I did earlier then I wouldn't even be I wouldn't even be able to make videos right now, but thank you so much. That added a a great uh, ray of light to my day and I felt better since this morning anyway and I greatly when I seen that I was like, "Oh, thank you so much. That is so special. That's an awesome Christmas gift." But yeah, back to uh back to the paranormal activity. Um Like right now, I'm hearing just little movements. Just you probably can't hear it on this microphone, but if anything is loud and clear enough, you probably you probably will be able to hear it. If it was, if it was as clear as what we've been hearing, then you can't miss it. But yeah, definite paranormal activity. Um, let me know if any of you have been experiencing any more today or last night, this weekend. I know I've made a lot of recent videos regarding that topic of that phenomenon of paranormal activity, and it's been happening again. The walking, the movement, the footsteps, the sounds, the voices, the objects moving, the sounds, the, uh, and a force was, a force was literally, uh, like I stated earlier, locking the door back as I was trying to unlock it there. Locking it back with my hand, just kind of, pushing it backward you could feel the force it was, it was and then it quit after three times but oh my goodness I'm so sorry about the uh, the notifications let me turn them off that was supposedly a notification from Twitter that NASA supposedly NASA released the first audio live audio recordings of Mars or something like that but that was what that notification was from the strange sounds Twitter page which I'll be giving an update on the uh, on the strange things the happening that are happening uh, but this is just a, a, a video regarding the strange things happening here, around me, and uh, in the house. Paranormal activity follows me, typically, whether it's the paranormal activity, Sasquatch activity, or cryptid activity, the strangeness that happens, the, the interdimensional beings, the spirit beings, anything like that usually happens... It usually just follows me around. No matter where I go, there's no getting away from it. It could be in the vehicle, the Nissan, the, uh, it could be in the, uh, the truck, the, the, uh, 
it could be in the uh, exterior or the uh, or the uh, I could be sitting in the uh, the truck the Sierra truck and it just the activity happens I could be sitting in uh, somewhat I could be in uh, my grandparents house I could be at my Nana's house and activity will happen outside inside the house wherever I'll put my hands out a certain way and just try to meditate and you'll hear movements and footsteps and walking and sounds and beings in the woods and beings right next to me and just footsteps around me that uh, but yet no one physicals there just all kinds of things that you you see that I see and hear around me that they just follow me no matter where I go I could be in the grocery store and something strange happens I was in there one day and suddenly the uh, and I was a distance away from it all of all of the cabbages just just one of them just lifted up and fell and this woman said well they all just went flying in they said yeah they did she said I seen that and or items will just go flying off the shelf one time I lifted this uh, this sprite carton and water started pouring out of it when I was in the grocery store that dude said well it just started pouring out of there like some kind of Chris Angel thing just manifesting water and it just started pouring like crazy and then kept pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring but none of the cans had leaked it's like it suddenly was filled with water water started manifesting I mean people just don't know what what happens what all happens and then something will go flying off the shelf or something like that just things like that but anyway, yeah, a lot more paranormal activity in the house um, and around me and around us lately. But that's what's happened today and yesterday and throughout this weekend up to now. But the grocery store circumstances, those events happened a few months ago. But what I've shared mainly happened recently and i thank that person so much for sending me that that beautiful calendar so thank you all so much god bless you all i'm glad i'm feeling better for now continue uh to send your prayers that i feel better thank you to the the commented prayers and all of everything that you you shared with me peace god bless you all i hope to speak with all of you again very soon this is an update on my paranormal activity peace bye